have questions about your Altair, hi, this is Sherry with My Girlfriend's Quilt Shop. Today we're going to take a look at how to use the question key on that baby lock Altair. Let's take a look at what happens when we push on the question key. For this one, it is helpful to go into the sewing section first and then click on this question mark. Here we have operation guide, sewing guide, pattern explanation, video, and the app guide. If you go into video, it features a series of videos that go over some of the basic things on your machine. The buttons, um, winding a butt bobbin, um, embroidery technique, IQ designer settings, accessories, maintenance. If we come up here to the operation guide, it will show us the principal parts, the principal buttons, the basic operation, embroidery basic operation, troubleshooting, and maintenance. If we select any of these, it will walk us through and show us the steps that we need to do to take care of that thing. Okay, then we go to basic operation. Here we have winding a bobbin. It has 22 pages that will take us through step by step on how to wind our bobbin. If we cl click on them, it will show us each steps and then it will have some basic animation to show us what to do on that step. When we return to this page, we can also look at the sewing guide that shows some fairly basic things that you can do on your sewing machine. It will show how to do them, it will talk about the settings, and it's kind of a helpful thing to walk you through this. So this is the button sewing, so it talks about what to do for a button, and we'll walk you through each of the steps to attach a button to your garment. I hope you learned all about the question key and how to find answers about your baby lock altair. Find us at mygirlfriendsquiltshop.com to get more questions answered and to purchase your baby lock altair.